good evening friends uh, welcome to the basic knee orthoplastic course uh, this is the first talk we are talking on uh, pre operative protocol for the total knee uh, replacement why do you think the knee protocol is important even though a well done tkr as you can see the surgeon has done very well tkr but the still the patient is complaining pain this is because the incidence of unhappy tkr is as high as up to 25% the reported range has come down now but still it is as high as 25% why do we think this unhappy tkr is there with this background let us start analyzing what are the important uh, things to prevent this unhappy tkr as we all know that the indication of tkr the most commonly is severe degenerative degenerative or inflammatory osteoarthritis there are other indications also where we have to do tkr like osteochondromatosis villonodal synovitis these are synovial pathologies sometimes there may be an osteonecrosis metabolic conditions like gout and uh, pseudo gout disorders and we have to do convert a post traumatic arthritis knee to total knee replacement sometimes acute arthritic knee with a fracture the intraarticular fracture which not dissolves that also has to go under tkr and rarely a failed uh, high tibial osteotomies or non dysfunctional uh, deformity of the knee these are the other indications which we do tkr but the most commonly we do tkr is for the cb degenerative arthritis with this background let us make a protocol what all things we have to look for a tkr the first and the foremost important thing is the thorough clinical history and examination why this thorough clinical history and examination is important because of the patient selection without patient selection proper patient selection the results are very 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 disastrous so the patient selection is very important for which thorough clinical and history is examination is important once the patient has been selected we have to do a pre operative medical assessment since this happens to be a elective case no mishaps should happens intra op and post op so pre operative medical assessment is very important now coming to local factors let us apart from that we also have to take the radiological examinations what the x ray is telling to us what the knee is telling via x ray and last we have to select which implant is required for all not all the shoes fits for the same uh, uh, all the fit that's the reason implant selection is also important